Hi, so for my marketing pro-am assignment, I had the chance to shadow a man named Pete Codella. He's director of management and communications at the Davis David Eccles School of Business at the University of Utah. He was, it was the the reason I got in contact with him, with him is because my mom works there also, so she knows him pretty well through work and just emailed him and asked him if I could go and visit with him and it, he said it was fine, so I was able to go and do it, but it was it was really interesting. When I first got there, he took me to his office, and we were just, um, he was, he just kind of started getting to work. He wasn't necessarily doing anything out of the ordinary special just because I was there, but we got there, and the, it was, it was kind of funny because he, it seemed like he's kind of working on, like, four or five assignments all at the same time. He kept on switching through all sorts of different stuff, depending on, like, someone sent him an email about one thing, so he, uh, he started working on that for a minute, and then he started working on another thing because he started working on a press release because it needed to be submitted today, and then he started then he had a meeting about other stuff, so we went to that meeting, but I'll tell you, I'll tell you all about all of that stuff, but the first thing we did is we got there and he started working on this press release that he was, he was finishing up and spell checking and all that sorts of stuff to submit to the dean of the business school who was then going to approve it to be submitted for the press, but it was, um, he didn't, didn't really talk that much about what it was about, but it was interesting to see his process of how he does that. He, he had one of their the business schools um people that specializes in just writing press releases and um like writing papers that needed to need to be submitted officially he had one of those ladies write up the paper and then she emailed it to him and he checked it on his computer then he um then he printed it off and checked it again then he took it to the lady who wrote it and they went over it again and then he edited it on his computer and then he submitted it to the dean but it was is an interesting process and then he started working on a podcast because since he's direct he's director of communications he um was he had to work on this podcast that they're going to be posting on the school website and it he said it'll just be it'll just be talking about the business school in general and then they're gonna do a whole series of podcasts and stuff but it was cool to see him editing and putting together that podcast and then having people approve it and then um then he got on a website called web press is how him and his team manage their websites and he got on web press and just submitted the video right through there and then it automatically we checked on our 
phones and computers and the the podcast was already up on the website and it was interesting to see see that and then we went to a meeting that he has with like his web head web designer and um a couple other people but went to a meeting and they were just talking about how like how their head of communications they make all the websites for all the different branches of the business school and um they were just talking about different things they needed to do on those websites making them more mobile phone and tablet friendly so that they look right on phones and tablets and it was interesting to hear that i actually got to go in the meeting and it was interesting to hear them talking about all those um all those different little tweaks and things of whatever they needed to do for the different websites and then after that we went back to his office and um checked on a topic that brought, got brought up about the dean about how the website wasn't working quite properly but they couldn't figure out what the problem was so we had to go up and talk to the dean about it and then they started talking about how they were scheduling different luncheons and meetings with the with the dean and how he was like supposed to fit it around his whole schedule um and then we went back to Pete Codella's office and he just started working on finishing up the podcast and stuff cuz it wasn't done yet but finishing up the podcast and then he s started showing me about how web press works and stuff and it was and then he had to create a logo for the podcast so he was showing me how he does that just through photo edit and then after that, it was pretty much, my time with him was pretty much over, but he just asked me if I had any questions and stuff, and then he gave me some advice. He's like, if you, if there's two skills that I feel maybe you should learn are how to use web press and then how to be able to use Photoshop easily more easily than how I know how to do because he said he was still just kind of learning how to do it because he's only been in his job for about three months he said but he said to learn how to use web press and photoshop but so I'll take his advice and hopefully learn how to use those two websites but overall it is a is a very fun interesting um opportunity to go and meet and shadow this the guy named his name was Pete and it was interesting and it interesting experience and I'm glad I got to do it